We're going to practice generating equivalent fractions in this video. Now, the way that you generate equivalent fractions is you either multiply or divide by the same number in both the numerator and denominator. For simplicity's sake, we're just going to practice with multiplying. The top left, you could see that we're going to practice first by multiplying all of these fractions by 2 on the numerator and denominator. So 1 half is actually equal to 2 fourths. That's an equivalent fraction. 2 thirds, when we multiply 2 times 2 in the numerator is 4, 3 times 2 in the denominator is 6, 2 thirds and 4 sixths are equivalent fractions, and so on and so forth. 6 eighths is equivalent to 3 fourths. Now, the reason that we have this again, times 3 and times 4, is because it doesn't matter what number you multiply by. As long as you are multiplying by the same number in the numerator and denominator, you're going to end up with an equivalent fraction. So as I continue these, you'll see I'm now multiplying both numerator and denominator by 3. 1 half is equal to 3 sixths. 2 thirds is equivalent to 6 ninths, and 3 fourths is equivalent to 9 twelfths. And last, we'll go ahead and find equivalent fractions by multiplying both sides by 4, both the numerator and denominator. And you'll see that this is just a very quick and easy way to generate um, equivalent fractions. Multiply by the same number on the top and the bottom.